Yo, how's it going, everybody? It's your Lord and Savior back with some new gaming. Mythbusters the game, to be exact. Now, this is a game I've been psyched out to play because I used to watch Mythbusters a lot growing up. For all of you guys who don't know what Mythbusters is, it's a show that started out on uh, Discovery uh, back in 2003. Uh, originally started with Jamie Heineman and Adam Savage. Basically, all they did was, you know, they'd take like scenes from movies, you know, videos, uh, rumors, myths, you know, all that jazz and try to figure out if their myth was real or cap. <laughs> That's basically it. <laughs> That's all they did. Uh, sometimes they get plausible results where, you know, it might work in this situation, but not that. But, you know, enough of that. Let's just jump in and try to do it ourselves, right? Because that's what we're here for. And through the magic of editing, we've skipped into the future again past the loading screen. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Mythbusters the game. Soon you'll be able to play the role of a real Mythbuster. Each myth will have its own unique gameplay mechanics, which you will encounter during the finalization and testing of the experiment. This is an early version of the game and not everything is going to be perfect. If you encounter any problems or if something's not clear, please contact us through our social media. Have fun. Okay. Let's see what we got here. Go to the myth board and choose a myth. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's the only one. Okay. Tips. Now you're going to pick the first myth for testing. The goal of the game is to get as popular as possible while still having enough budget for your experiments. During the game, you'll get cards to assemble the episodes. Appropriate usage of these cards in the episode allow you to gain a higher popularity and budget. How much money you can earn is shown on the bottom of the card. How many new fans you'll get will be shown at the bottom of the card. All right. So let's see, this, this lady's got 3x money. Celebrities can make audiences stick around. Um, sometimes. All you need is ambitious people that are fun to work with. Yeah, I have 3X fans. S Sergeant Daniel. He has been working with guns and explosives for years. Those experiences and anecdotes she will share will be shared with future generations. Um. Yeah, I think I'll go with this guy because he has no negatives. I like positives. All right. You can find additional objectives under the myth description. It is worth completing uh, them in order to gain extra cards for your uh, episode. However, they are not required to unlock more tests or myths. Oh, interesting. OK, so let's read this. Heroes Gambit. Action movie heroes tend to find a way to survive a grenade blast within seconds. Is it possible to survive a grenade explosion by covering it with an object and hiding behind a suitable cover, a bucket, a barrel, or even a wooden box? What would be the best way to uh, stop the explosion? So this unlocks experiments, run for your life, test firepower of a grenade, an exponential explosion, save two test mock-ups from destruction by a grenade and dynamite, last action heroes, save three mock-ups, all right. All right, what do we do now? Uh, so there's a marker over here, so I guess I'll go over here. <laughs> I'll run for that test, so I guess I click that. And mm, I guess I'll click this one as close as. Click and drag the ball. Make sure all the objects drawn with the li white lines are disappear. So, um, so maybe if I go this way from an angle. Oh, that doesn't work. Mm. What, if, what if I bounce it this way? Aha! <laughs> Waha! I should have read those lines, didn't I? <laughs> that would have told me those wouldn't bounce. Okay, all right, next. Uh, determine the percentage of the area. Click the within the body to fill it. Then apply to check. So I need sixty-three percent. So that's that's gonna be sixty. No, that's fifty. So that's sixty. See, I look really good enough. Si oh my god! I called six on the dot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
All right. Oh, geez. Let's click and drag puzzles. Mm, the solid ones can't be moved. So, oh, geez. Um, so let's move you down. Over. Okay. Okay, that doesn't work the way I want. Okay. Yeah, we got that. Mm. Of you there. And move you. Oh, geez. Yeah, that's not going to work out. Oh, no, it will. I do this. So we move that out there, move that there, there. Up, up, and over. Got it! Oh, I had moves. Whoops, I didn't realize I had moves. I was just dragging pieces around. So I got lucky. All right, so move the matchsticks. Solve the equation by moving a specific number. So I have two moves. Wait, okay, okay. Well, back in the future, I think I figured it out. Hold on. So what do we move there? Eight minus zero. Oh, yes! And that long pause of me trying to figure that out in my head will, of course, disappear into the ether of the power of editing. <laughs> so we're good there. Let's go. All right. Open notebook with Q. Here you can find information of what you have to do in order to accomplish the test. All right. You can find additional objectives under the myth description. It's worth uh, completing them in order to gain extra cards for the episode. However, they are not required to unlock more tests or myths. All right. Run for your life. Prepare the grenade and build a test mock-up. When you're ready, Place everything on the testing ground so it, that the test mock-up does not get destroyed. One grenade, one test mock-up. Use heavy cover. Okay. All right. Sounds good. Change notebook page. See? Okay. On this page, you can find the table of contents. Yellow icons show the places uh, in which there is something to do. As a part of the experiment, you will find detailed information on a relevant page. Okay. So that's page number. Item. Okay. Next. So review all pages. So for this igniter, I need a piezo uh, electric igniter and a grenade. And for a plank, I need six wood planks, two wood beams and eight nails. OK. Uh, wood plank. Uh, OK, for one beam. OK. Startup console, set up stuff there. OK, OK. Lethal zone, metal covers guarantee survival of the A zone. High disruption zone, wooden uh, is in the B area, and low destruction is plastic at the range. Okay. Here you will start the explosion. Okay. Okay. Uh, close. Oh, marker notebook fish, done. You to close. Uh huh. Okay, so close the notebook. All right, let's see what I need. So I need one grenade. Well, actually, there'll be a mark, right? Let's just go to all the stuff that's marked. So start button. I need one start the button. Done. Grenades. There's a box of grenades just sitting around. Wait, that's a block of C4 and sticks of dynamite. Oh, geez. All right, let's see. What do we have here? Wood saw. Uh, I need one wood saw. Got it. Next, wood planks. Uh, six wood planks. And with the beams, I need a two of them. Okay. Okay. What do we have here? A hammer. I need uno hammer. I need eight nails. 
and I need a Uno wrench. And then from here, I need a Pizio electric igniter. There we go. Done. Got everything. Done. Check notebook page three. Okay. Uh huh. That's page. Okay. That's page three. There's a list of necessary components needed to create an item. On the left, you can see the name in the, in the middle shows you the required quantity. And the icon on the right shows a place in which you can obtain the components. Okay. So, easy. Uh, you can often find uh, useful information. Yes. Okay. So, go to small workshop. Ah. It's a really nice workshop. I do have to say that. Really nice workshop. All right, let's go around here. E. Easy electric grenade. Remove the grenade fuse by holding down the mouse button. I'm pretty sure this is something you should not be doing, but okay. Oh, disassemble mode. Hey, hold on. I'm in disassemble mode. Okay, uh, missing from backpack. There's no grade. Oh, geez. Oh, I deleted the part. Gotta go buy another grenade. <sighs> oh geez, there's a sprint button. And it works great. Run! I knew this. I'd be running across the place. Safety not first. Okay. This is simple mode. There it is. It's Z. I'm pretty sure that's something you do not want to do. Just saying. Just take item. Done. Uh, open backpack. Done. Move wrench to tool belt. Okay, wrench to tool belt. A uh, hammer to tool belt. Sure, why not? Move all tools. Okay, done. Oh, uh, that there. And put that there. So yellow is tools. Got it. Quick select icon. Okay. With the wrench. Done. Next page. All right. Sometimes we have to prepare some pieces of the component in place marked with an icon. Okay. You can find detailed information about the, uh, the place on the page indicated on the orange box. Okay. So go to page five. Okay. There we go. Read the contents of the page. Okay. So you use a saw, you stab it with a plank, and then a wood beam, and it becomes a plank. Got it. Assemble a saw. Let's go. Whee! E. Alright. Oh, man. Pretty sure I should not be that close to a saw blade. Just saying. Okay. Wow, some assembly acquired, even in your workshop. Okay. Okay, so I gotta use some wood beams. Movement. H. You know, information on this though. Okay. Oh, okay. Gotta just move the mouse and pray I'm on the right spot. Okay. Oh, perfect. Cool. Oops. Enough for me. Okay. Next, requires a hammer. Okay. So we switch the hammer. There we go.
Oh, there it is. He run. Boing. Oh, okay. Craft test mock up. Some of some are required, I'm guessing. Ah, oh, there we go. Well, oh, God, these controls. Oh, there we go. I can click on the item and it works. Okay. Okay. Do you have any these? Got it. Got it. And what do we do there? Mount. Okay. Um, I guess we want the middle first. And we want you to wave. And um, there you go. Keep your arm at your side. We got some nails. Some assembly acquired. Nail in now. There you go. Okay, take item. Done. All right. Test mock up in your hand. Take mock up in your hand. Okay. Done. Transfer the truck. Run! Oh god, ran too quick. Mm, drop mock up. Done. Head to shooting range. Okay, how do I head to shooting range? Oh, okay. An awkward place. Could have just, you know. We're at Buster Hall. Shooting range. Let's go. Ah, another magical uh, edit from the editing room. We're in the future again. All right. Oh, geez. In frame rates back here. All right. What do we do back here? Uh, check notebook page six. OK. Yeah, we're doing that. Ah, oh, okay. Myth busting area. Click on the pages marked. Okay. Revival tips. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Oh, they locked the room up. I don't have to pick up the more buddy. Are you still in the trunk, man? Yes, you are. Open test me. Thank you. Run. All right. Now I got to look at the book, page seven. Okay, so right here. Okay. Oh, I'll take the grenade from my inventory. Yeah, you you sit here for now. What cleanup crew? Oh, I had to grab the item from my inventory. Yeah, stay there. There we go. Check notebook page eight. Okay, so we gotta go 
the last room and put in our button. Okay, we got a button. Start the experiment. Okay. So we need to put our buddy. Where do I put my buddy? start the experiment stay there. Is there another button I have to hit up here okay you have to do the start button without that okay all right um got our buddy uh we're gonna mount you right here since you're in point blank we want we want to use the heavy cover yes and put it right here. And we're gonna put the crate here. That's what we're supposed to do. Okay. Done. All right. Detonate the grenade. Yay! Here you can see what you've managed to achieve during the experiment. On the left side of the screen. You can see which cards can be received for your achievements. Uh, once you've restarted the experiment, you lose all your achievements. Uh, they will be restored to the state at the beginning of the experiment. Uh, I'm good. End experiment. Done. Um, some items you can get back from the scrapyard. This is an option that allows you to save money, but objects will have to be remade from scratch. Uh, repair costs. Sure. All right. You have enough cards for an episode two Buster Hall. Don't even need to jump into the future for that. Look, now we're in loaded. Where's where do we go? Um. Oh, OK. Upstairs. Open the laptop at E. Okay. E. Here you can check the inbox, read mail. Sometimes you'll find nice messages from fans or useful hints. Here you can create new episodes to gain money and popularity. To edit episodes, select that. Okay, done. Each episode has five empty slots that be filled with collected cards. Move your first card into a slot. Um, so we'll put plausible at the end. Done. All right, there's a duration. Each episode must be at least 50 minutes and not over an hour. Okay, I got it. After completing an entire episode, you will be able to record its full length as appropriate. You'll get money for further work. Fill in the gaps. Okay. Um, that's what, 15 minutes? And that's... Flash of genius. Okay, pondering on an idea while we can reveal the new perspective. What's up, people? Perfect plan. Okay. So, I'll put that there. Get a tools up at the beginning. Get a flash of genius. And we got 10 minutes left. What else do we want? We want some. Oh, geez. We need a lot more fans. We got no fan buffs. Uh, put that over there. And boom! I don't want tools up right there. Um, hmm. Let's move that there. Perfect plan. And then that up and that there. Uh, it's still 3,200. <laughs> I think these are all ending numbers, so I guess we'll tools up. Um, nope, nope. We'll flash a genius and tools up. There you go. Record an episode. Okay, so that's the first thing. Hey, we're we got some fans. A design experiments on a blueprint. What we got? Oh. Oh, okay. So we finished the first episode. 
So we got to save two mockups in the next one. So actually, what I'm going to do is uh, we're going to save that for the next episode. If uh, you guys are interested in seeing more, I'll probably throw a poll in the description. Just uh, let me know if you want to see more of this content. But as always, if you like it, drop a like. If you hate it, slam that thumb down, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.